Hi everyone, my name is Dan and today I will be showing you how to tie a necktie. The method we are going to use is the foreign hands knot and it is the easiest and most common way to wear a necktie. It's easiest to put a tie on with the collar of your shirt popped and buttoned up like so. Every tie has two sides, the smooth part is the front and the part you want showing. From here, wrap the tie around your neck with the seam side pressed against your body. It doesn't matter which side you put the fat part on and the skinny part on. Personally, I'm a righty, so I like to start with the fat end on the right hand side of my body. Adjusting the length of the tie is probably the trickiest part. Once the tie is dangling around your neck, adjust it so that the fat side is at least twice as long as the skinny side. Some will tell you that the skinny end should be touching your rib cage. Once you have your necktie set up, you are ready to begin the tying process. Grab the fat side of your tie with your right hand and cross it over the skinny side, forming an X in the center of your chest. Pinch the center of the X with your left hand pointer finger and thumb. Next, use your right hand to reach across your body and grab the fat end once again. Pull it under the skinny end first and then wrap it over your left hand pinch. You now have a slot ready to insert the fat end of the tie through. Still using your right hand, bring the fat end of the tie through the bottom of the loop you've created between your neck and left hand pinch. Slip the fat end of the tie through the slot you've created and gently pull it through until it is completely untangled. It is now time to adjust the tightness of the knot and the length of the tie. Use your left hand to grab the skinny end of the tie, which now lies under the fat part showing. Use your right hand to grab the bulk of the knot. Slide your right hand upward and your left hand downward simultaneously. This will extend the part of the tie you are showing and will tighten up the knot you've created. Pull the tie to your neck, but don't exaggerate the step too much because you don't want to make the knot too tight or the tie too long. The bottom should lay right around your belt buckle. You can now cuff the collar of your shirt and insert the skinny end of the tie into the seam sleeve if you wish. I hope this video was helpful to you. Thank you for watching.